New for you this morning, we're following up with a Buffalo woman who was told she only had up to five years left to live. I first introduced you to Kristen two years ago. At 37, she was diagnosed with ALS, a debilitating disease that causes nerve cells to break down and muscles to weaken. Right now, there's no cure. She has been advocating for new treatments and research to help her and others in the same situation. But as Jordan Johnson shows us, Kristen now needs your help getting treatment. Hi, Jordan. Yeah, good morning, Ed and Katie. It's been four years since Kristen was diagnosed, and many people with the disease only live two to five years after they get their diagnosis. But she's determined to fight, and now a local ice cream shop is raising money to help her access treatment to do it. A shining bright light. It's shocking, honestly. It was, uh, I mean, you don't know how you're going to respond to news like that. But I knew in that moment I wasn't going to let ALS define me because as soon as I did, it would defeat me. More than three years ago, Kristen Getz got the news that would change her life. She was diagnosed with ALS. ALS, also known as Lou Gehrig's disease, is a neurodegenerative disease that affects nerve cells in the brain and spinal cord. It leads to difficulty speaking, swallowing, and breathing. ALS is also a progressive disease, meaning it worsens over time. Expectancy of someone with ALS is two to five years. But Kristen was not going to let it stop her from living her life to the fullest. And be your own best advocate. No one else is going to fight for you like you will for yourself. Now Kristen is asking for help in receiving treatment in Florida that costs $7,500 a week, not including housing. People have regained functionality. It slowed down a lot of people's progression and just to have hope that it could do something or at least stall it out just, you know, helps me keep fighting. Which is where Great Lakes Station, the caboose, comes in. Owner Tammy Metzger's own father lost his battle to ALS more than 16 years ago, and she normally hosted a fundraiser in his honor. Now this year, she is giving Kristen the fighting chance for more life and more time. This Sunday, supporting a local business and getting a sweet treat could have a lasting impact. It's just a terrible, terrible, awful disease and anything anybody can do to come down and donate some funds to her and say hi to her and brighten her day would be greatly appreciated. The event is from noon to 10 p.m. and you can help Kristen fight for a brighter future. Such a blessing. I'm so thankful for it. And again, that ice cream shop is at Three Commerce Parkway in Buffalo, and it's from 12 until close. You know, when you think of how young she is yeah. and what kind of a situation she's in, this is where the Buffalo strong spirit really kicks in. We know Buffalo comes through for neighbors in need. Yep, so mark your calendar Sunday if you can make it there. The help would greatly be appreciated. She is such a nice person, she too. She is, yes. I cried a few tears. Oh, yes, she's very yeah. sweet.